Movies this weekend, the pickings are slim. Take a look at my Dean's List reviews. Farmer's daughter, take one. I need to be famous, Wayne. All the best people are. There ain't nobody else out there like you. You know why? Why? You got that X factor. At the movies this weekend, there's the horror offering called X. This time, the thinly veiled premise is that a group of friends decide to head out to a remote farm to make an adult movie. Only the elderly couple who own the property are not so crazy about the young filmmakers or what they're doing. It's rated R and is in theaters only. You cannot make something good until you understand the customer. Do we let all of our customers keep black boxes in back? If we only allowed angels to be customers, soon we'd have no customers at all. Also new this week is the twist-filled Chicago set 1950s crime story, Jesus, The I Outfit. The story of a neighborhood master tailor who makes clothes for the gangsters and is thrown into the middle of a game of deception and murder with them. It is also rated R. All right, rise and shine. Wake up, Ella, or this video goes on your Instagram in three, two... Dad, no! Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. I really feel like there were a few extra children in there. I didn't recognize some of them. There's also the newest version of the family comedy, Cheaper by the Dozen. This time, Gabrielle Union and Zach Braff blend their two diverse families together, hitting every 2022 trend in technology, trying to make the movie relatable to a new audience. It's a weak effort, but one that is ultimately harmless. A Dean's List C- only on Disney+. You can always get my weekly movie reviews sent right to your phones every week just by texting the word Dean to 97999. Sponsored by Lyric Opera of Chicago's Tosca now through April 10th. Get tickets at lyricopera.org.